I'm worried about EV fires. You better or worse than we have right now? Substantially better. So basically, in a solid state battery, we have replaced that volatile and flammable liquid and gel polymer electrolyte with a very stable uh, solid ion conducting material, in all, our case, a sulfide based uh, ion conducting material, such that under standard abuse conditions, such as crush, nail penetration, et cetera, our cells may still fail, but they do so in a very benign, non catastrophic manner. Instead, uh, so in other words, instead of a thermal runaway on your hands, you simply have a dead brick. Wow. Okay. Well, how about uh, price? Because you know these things need to come down 50%. Uh, it, in order to be able to get this thing going? I mean, what, where, where can they really go down? How much can they go down? And how much can they go down in weight? Because we know that weight's an issue and price is an issue. Yep, weight, volume, and price. So, you know, it's interestingly, I tell my team here at Solid Power that we're in the business of delivering on dollars per kilowatt hour. Let's never forget that. And in our case, solid state is simply a means to, to get there. The way we deliver uh, on uh, very low dollars per kilowatt hours, first of all, taking advantage of being in solid state form. Now that we're uh, inherently safer, as well as having far superior high temperature stability in comparison to today's lithium ion, uh, we believe and our OEM partners believe that the design of future EV battery packs incorporating solid state batteries will be substantially simpler. Things like pack cooling uh, could potentially be eliminated uh, along with a lot of safety features. So that would drive down the cost uh, at, the, at the pack level. Don't miss a second of Mad Money. Follow at Jim Kramer on Twitter. Have a question? Tweet Kramer. Hashtag Mad Tweets. Send Jim an email to madmoney at cnbc.com or give us a call at 1 800 743 CNBC. Miss something? Head to madmoney.cnbc.com.